What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Spider-Man Squarepants Battle for Bikini Ball. Let's take a moment to admire this music. Isn't it great? It's fantastic. It's creepy. It's creepy in a weird kind of way, like in a weird, serene kind of way. It does feel kind of dreamy. Well, not really, because it's really fast, and it's not really what you would expect it to be. You can get to listen to the music here, too. Okay, that's good. It sounds almost kind of tragic, doesn't it? Wow, your dream is massive. That's what she said. Everything in Texas is big, even dreams. Then you're just the right person to reach the spatula on top of that golden oh, acorn. Holy. That's not a golden acorn, that's a normal brown acorn. <laughs> my dream, my rules. I'll get that spatula faster than a Texas jackrabbit crossing a four lane highway. Whoa. Okay. And with this, actually. Brings, as far as I'm aware, the fastest shiny object grinding spot in the game. Oh, great, I missed it. I wanted to grab that purple shiny object first. Um, we do actually do it better with sponge food. Uh -huh. I guess what you're supposed to do, you're supposed to creep across. Come on. Believe it or not, you can actually jump and not have these things, like, move. As long as you just keep like moving at the same rate, ah ha ha! I did it! I did it! Do I make it back there? I don't. Ah, uh, maybe. Okay, there we go. Anyways, the fastest way to grind shiny objects in this game, what I'm gonna probably be doing a lot off screen as of now, is doing that uh, super ultra mega monster combo, and then jumping off. Every time you do it, let's see here. We got uh, thirteen seven hundred. 30,700 uh, shiny objects. Ow. That gave us a little over uh, 200. Oh, I wonder if it is. 280. Hmm, I wonder if there's a faster one then. That doesn't seem like that much. And that's weird. Three of the stone tiki's didn't break that time. Meanwhile, like, uh, only what two were left before. Anyways, yeah, so this is pretty much what I always do, and it respawn, uh, spawns you right back there. So it kind of makes sense to use this one. And see, we're already we're up to, like, already 1,400 and a half, and that, that's pretty good. Oh, I, I missed. Well, that happens. <laughs> oh, boy, there's really no, no point in to do this. Ah! Oh, I tried. Okay, anyways, that's all I was going to show of that. That's pretty much the main gist of it. And that's probably how I'm going to be grinding for uh, shiny objects. So I can get the... Golden spatulas for Mr. Krabs, and also other such things, such as the secret thing, the secret theater thing, which I don't even remember what that does. I'm trying to think of what the heck it does. I think it might have something to do with the credits, but that doesn't make sense because the credits appear at the end of the game. I don't think it does. Anyways, here we go. Sandy's dream is a gigantic freaking slide. I haven't really mentioned it yet, but this level really likes their slides a lot. Don't really know why. There's manure. You know, this is it's freaking tank, this is the manure, and it's freaking spice things. The spice. Alright, there are a whole bunch of branching paths that you gotta make sure you go the left path here, I think. I think, and there's, what are those, I was gonna say two or three, two whoops! Oh, crap. Um, the first pit stop is actually over here. There are a lot of pit stops here. Hey, yep. This is indeed Hello, a level. Franken. And, yep, That's I don't know if you guys saw planes over here. With a backbone. What? Um, oh, 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 okay. Who puts challenges in their own dreams? <laughs> Squirrels, we're tough like that. Tough like that? Oh, you'll need to be real tough to make this series of swings. Oh, it really actually doesn't look difficult at all. I am not I worried. I'm my sleep. You are you sleeping. Are asleep. Yeah, pretty much. As I said, in my sleep. Well, in my dreams. Well, there's a golden spatula out there for you if you make it far enough. I'll do it so fast, it'll make your head spin faster than a horny toad on a merry-go-round. Oh, uh, okay. Why can't I ever just dream normal dreams of world domination? Yeah, why sh Why is in my dream? What? These... These swingers lead to <laughs> something. Okay. These swingers lead to something. Is there anything back here? There is not. Hmm. Okay, well, I thought it was worth a try. A little look see. Is there anything up here? I get. I always get the feeling that I'm missing stuff. Oh, we can't even jump up here. Weird. Okay, well, anyways. Oh, I, I missed I missed the spot. Here we go. We'll go this way. Ah! There we go. Uh-huh. 
Really not looking too scary. Who designed this? Because this is supposed to be the last level of the game. This is pretty easy. Oh, well, I spoke too soon. <laughs> but really, that, that was a stupid mistake. I released it too soon. I figured I'd be able to make it from there, but no. This really is... Oh, I guess it is Sandy's dream, so it's like she wanted to make it easy enough for her. And yeah, we just, I guess we, you actually do have to go as far as you possibly can. No, And then, there we go. Holy crap, I almost swung over it. Uh, nope, we're not going to be able to make that. Holy crap! Are you serious? Stop it! You need to end your world domination right now. Get away! Oh, no! Okay, uh, I'm not, I'm not gonna even... Oh, God. Oh! There, oh, cool! I didn't do that. Oh, God. Uh, get out of the... Uh, I kind of wish we could do this as SpongeBob, I'm not gonna lie, but we cannot. Uh, okay, if we could hit this... If we could hit this... Oh, no! Oh, this is not looking too good for the Sandinator. Alright, um... We, we get you from here. There we go. We can indeed. Okay, if we get this fodder into this G love, I'd be very much appreciate. Oh my good lord! No, it's not even worth it. Uh, well, now are you serious? Uh oh, oh, wow. what? It? Oh, that was a thunder tea. I was like, what? What did that even destroy? Oh great! Uh, uh, uh. Yes, I missed. This is my sliding. There we go. And for some reason the special comes down I don't know I don't freaking know you know I would assume not but you might you do leave a comment down below why the heck does the golden special jump down from the roof is it suicidal it should seek help I'm good at helping people you know what because consider I got 60 golden specials from helping people it should have helped ask me to help okay anyways that's that we're not actually done here because if you look carefully you'll see a little sparkly sparkle and if we go over here Okay, I did not think we were gonna make it there for a second. I do not know if we would have grabbed the ledge. There's actually a door over here. Why should you go in here? That would have been cool. What the heck is what's all the glass there? Looks like there's some kind of weird design here. I almost better look at that. No, it looks like a person or actually to me at first it looked like Iron Man. I don't freaking know. Alright, get back over here and then you can jump back on this gigantic trampoline. A big ass trampoline, sucker. Everything's bigger in Texas, apparently. Oh, it just leads us right back here. Say anything funny, Plankton? Uh, all this beautiful mayhem wasted on some brainless tin cans. <laughs> brainless tin cans? What? You talking about those things? Brainless tin cans? What does that even mean? I don't know. I'm too stupid. I'm too stupid for Plankton's geniusness to handle. All right. Anyway, let's continue down the slide. Uh-huh. Okay. Like I said, the good redeeming thing here... I think you actually want to go this way in the manure. The good redeeming thing here is that... Oh, God. Um, you do have the hover jump. Should you ever need it? It's weird how you get game momentum going up here in this game. I thought it was way. Okay, there we go. Okay, if you don't press X there, there's no way... You're gonna be able to get the next item that's on our list. Oh, great, I'm dead, aren't I? I'm so dead. You are so D E A D dead. I just spelled it right for once. Uh, and yep, you get a golden sock. I mean, a sock. Not really golden at all. Still making that mistake. 67 socks into the game. Oh, God! Well, at least I survived, kind of. Okay, at this point, I'd be okay with dying. Can we go over there? No, nope, doesn't look like it's dark, so I'm gonna assume no. Oh no, it's these things! <laughs> Stop throwing pies at me! <laughs> I love that is pretty funny. Manure or pie throwing cows is like what? That's so weird and they look so mad. Why so mad bro? Oh What? Nuh-uh. I wanna go down there. You know what? Let's grab the checkpoint right for you now. Checkpoint! There we go. <laughs> Give it to me. Do I, okay, I was gonna say, have I called? Do I know what these guys are called? Yes, they're called choppers! Oh, good lord. Uh, there's oh, there's a sock right here! I didn't see that! Let's that sock there the entire time. Uh, ah, there we go. Oh, but I'm dead. Of course, why not? Why not? Why did the sand cross the road? Is there anything here? 
What's this? Sliding Texas style. Super bounce. Take the super base. Yeah. Okay. Kill you first off. That's weird. You can't lasso some enemies. Like, you can't lasso these guys. Oh, perfect. Um, what else can we lasso? Well, we can't lasso the little guys. I, like, I, don't, I don't get why not. I mean, you imagine those will be easier to lasso. Well, maybe not. Um, I don't know. I don't recall anything being this way, but let's take a look, anyways. This is a big place. Now, it looks kind of. What is this, an oil rig? Yes, it's an oil rig. It's cool. Uh, oh, it's so freaking huge. Like, look at that. That's massive. That's what she said. <laughs> okay, how many socks are in this level? Five. Okay, we have gone. We have, there's three socks in Sandy's level. And. That's, that's it. <laughs> the other two are on another level, so we don't have to worry about socks here anymore. All I have to do is worry about getting to the end of the world as we know it. This path seems skinnier to you guys. It seems skinnier to me. Now it seems widening a bit. Now it seems skinnier. Hmm, weird. Okay, all we gotta do is survive to the top. I'm definitely noticing spinning the camera as you slide makes it a lot easier as well. Come on, spin, 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 spin! There we go. Oh! Oh! Oh, cool, bro. We're going through a freaking bullhorn, I think. I think that's what it is. And there's stars inside. The universe lies inside the bullhorn of Mexico. Or not Mexico. And there's also a whole bunch of manure in the brain of a freaking bull for some reason. I don't freaking know. You know, because if you do, please leave a message to 1 800 111 not one, but one. Like, I won. I want to be your brother. I don't know. Okay, well, anyways. See, look how wide this is. It's weird. Ah, fine! Well, it spent, spent me going backwards. Okay, freaking utters. I, I'm in utter disbelief at this level. <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna hit me this time. Oh, what well, that is. And, oh, that's it! Honestly, I remember this being a lot bigger of a level than this, but I guess not! Yay! We did it! We did it with all our amazing amazingness. And if we look back, we can watch the cow as he does some cowalicious things. I don't know. Oh, they have red, white, and blue um, balloons. Can we, what happens if we go back here? I should have activated that um, teleport box while I was there. I, what happens if I touch you? Can I touch you? Oh well, you're a solid object. Okay, well let's let's. I, I don't know what I wanted to accomplish by doing that, but I did it! I did it, guys! Woo! And that's it. Does Larry say anything useful? Larry's like looking. You're looking the wrong way, bro. Wow. If anyone was going to make it down this sky slide, it was going to be you. Oh, I mean, I don't mean to blow. Holy! Look how tall he is compared to me. I go up to his belly button. Jeez. Okay, maybe I go up to his boob. Look at his freaking face. Terrifying! Oh god, okay. With that, we're done, but we can't leave us Sandy, unfortunately. It's weird. This is the only time I think where you come into a level with SpongeBob and you get um, put into the level as a different character. But yeah, we can only leave us SpongeBob! And we live on a Texas Ranger Star Sheriff badge thing. Exit. Alright. Bye, Sandy's Dream. We're already a third through my favorite, or fourth, I guess through my favorite level of the game. I, I like it because there's a whole bunch of mini levels. I don't know, a lot more fun than the huge levels for some reason, I don't know. Uh, anyway, let's go up here. Oh boy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh my god! Well, that was easy. Wow, I expected that to be a lot more difficult than it actually was. Okay then. Oh, well, that's like two golden spatulas. Is there anything this way? There's some freaking underpants that I don't need. Anyways. Uh, what? How they hit me from. Well, I guess. Well, that was pretty far. This is a small island compared to Sandy's place. Anyways, it's weird. It only costs a thousand shiny objects to get. And, like I said, there's lots of them in the game, so you'd imagine they used to cost a lot more than they do. But they don't. Uh, Special looks so weird over there. Look at them floating in the sky by those freaking crappy patties. Anyways, in the next episode, we'll be taking on Squidward's Dream, which is the one I'm pretty scared of, actually. Actually, all these are pretty challenging. Well, this one in particular is pretty challenging. Mr. Krabs is also pretty challenging. Patrick's. Oh, God, I'm terrified for Patrick's. 
Huh. If any of you play this game before, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't even pretend like you don't. Anyways, in the next episode, Scooter Dream. Thanks a lot for watching. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like Scooter already. My name's Chris. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye! Face the camera, SpongeBob. Face the freaking camera. There we go.